Okay, hello there. Um, right, it's finally come. The eye kettle. I uh, got this from Firebox. Promised it uh, to me before Christmas. Uh, and now it's the 13th of February and we finally got it. But there we go. Had to do some extra testings and um, to make sure it was safe. Obviously I don't want to uh, electrocute myself. So, um, this is the box. Now, what I'm going to do with this uh, re review is pretty much not a full unboxing because I've already unboxed it, um, but I've got it all up and running and I just want to run through um, what I've thought of it, my initial thoughts on the actual eye kettle and um, you know what it comes in. So, there you are, this is the, the packaging. Um, eye kettle, I've got an iPhone so I've linked it in with that and I'll tell you about that in a minute. Um, on the side they've got a little scanner so you can scan and get the um, uh, the app straight off uh, these are a few things that it does product features uh, remote boil via smartphone digital temperature settings keeps war keep warm fit a function stainless steel design uh, boil ready notification alerts concealed heat element boil dry protection that's really required when you're not actually right next to the to the kettle all the time. Uh, removable filter, um, easy clean design, cordless 360 body, LED uh, backlight control panel, um, wireless 8.2.11, um, and you've got eye kettle and a Wi-Fi base unit. It says goodbye to waiting, which that's why I bought it. Okay, good. So, so um, that's the uh, the kettle the box. Um, you get an instruction manual with it. I got uh, a welcome, congratulations on being one of the first to own a Wi-Fi kettle. Uh, Twelve month warranty. Interesting one as well. I got uh, thanks for waiting. I kettle skins. We would like to offer you a discount on I kettle skins as a thank you for your patience and support. 20% uh, off Wi-Fi kettle uh, dot com and then the promo uh, code there. Um, I won't show you that, but basically that's what they look like. To be honest, I probably won't buy one because I like I like the um, stainless steel look of it. And then obviously my Firefox in uh, invoice as well. Right, so there we go. So that's uh, that's that. What I'm going to do now is uh, we'll go and show you um, the smartphone um, feature and the kettle as well, so um, I'll be back in a second. Okay, right, um, I've got my iPhone here um, and uh, with the app on it. I downloaded it from the um, App Store. Um, you could obviously uh, just go onto the QR code here, QR code, sorry. Um, and download it from, from there, but I went to the iStore ice store and uh, typed in iKettle. Up it came, download it, took a few minutes. Um, now what happened, when I first downloaded it, there's a few screens that you have to set up, and it says about configuration. Now, um, that was all well and good, but actually it didn't work first go. Um, it just uh, said, take a few minutes to set up. Um, I had to put my Wi-Fi code in, I'd done that. Um, but generally speaking, it didn't actually it didn't work first time. So I closed it down, reopened it again. Um, it connected to the kettle, and we were fine second second time. So don't wait for ages and ages if you get one of these and think it doesn't work. Close down the app, restart the app, do it again closer to the kettle, and uh, it'll work absolutely fine. So um, let me just try and show you this. So uh, we'll load it all up, and that's what. Uh, what comes now? <laughs> I can't actually see the front of the camera, so sort of. Uh, so hopefully I'm getting it about right. There we go. Okay, so that's what you get. Um, and there's the on-off switch there. There's, this is a little. You might only just be able to see it. You might. Uh, this is a warming function. Then there's uh, 65, 80, 95, and 100. Um, that's the degrees of of uh, how hot you want the water. Obviously, um, boiling is what I'll usually set it up. But if you want. Um, I think green tea they say set it at 65 you want white tea um, sort of um, 80 
coffee at 95 and black tea at 100. Um, but you can choose whatever you want from that. Right, OK. Also, there's settings. Now, um, what are the settings? Well, the settings... Sorry, let me get it close to the screen. There you go. Um, settings, um, wake-up mode. What, what does that do? Well, I've set it for 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock in the morning, it'll wake me up and say, do you, do you want to turn the kettle on? So, absolutely ideal. That's why I got it. So I click yes, and when I come downstairs, I can make me hot drink without waiting for it to uh, to boil. Um, communication setup, obviously I've done that. It says tea making a, a guide. Don't know, not locked in that, not bothered looking at that. Product, um, product specifications, um, technical support, and manual. Um, so uh, so it's all on there. But um, let's go to done. Right, okay, so um, yeah, I want a cup of tea. So uh, let's uh, let's turn it on. There you go, red circle there. I don't know if you heard in the background, my kettle's three doors along, um, so you could hear it you know, audibly um, make a noise to say that the actual thing is switched on, and there you go, it's 100 degrees that it's going to be reaching temperature um, up to. Okay, so um, there we go. That is uh, the on-off function. Um, we'll go and have a look at the kettle now, once it's boiled, and, um, uh, and I'll show you the Okay, well, uh, I thought I'd come out and uh, actually show you the, the kettle in use. Um, it's not quite boiled um, as yet, but there it is. Nice stainless steel. Um, I wasn't particularly enamoured with the fact that it hasn't got uh, any lines here for, for how um, full the kettle is. That's actually inside, in the top. I um, wasn't particularly over-impressed by that, but... Um, there you go, perhaps that'll be in the a next model, but you can fill it right up to the top. Um, nice plastic. This does not get hot at all. This does not get hot at all, which is quite good. I thought maybe you get uh, transfer of heat from that, but you don't. Um, On-off button, obviously. There's the settings there of um, uh, the warming function. 65, 80, 95 and 100. Um, there we go, it's getting ready to close to boiling. I'll just put onto my um, up again. So there you go. Boiling, boiling, boiling. Obviously the whole point of this is not to stand by a boiling kettle waiting for it to do. You're meant to do this when you're in a different room. But I just wanted to show you uh, what it actually says once it happens. There we go. Maybe you can see that your kettle has finished heating. Okay. Lovely. And there we go. It goes back to, to, to there again. And now, obviously what I expect you can probably do is put the warm function on. Yeah, remember to refill your kettle, that's very good. Remember to refill your kettle, okay. So what I've got is I've now got the uh, reboiling function and that'll keep boiling to 100 de de no, degrees and keep it at that temperature. But uh, I don't need that, so I shall turn that off. Yeah, no longer keep me warm. Turn that off. Oh, hang on, what's happening up here? There seems to be a network issue. Alright, try again. I don't know what that was, but there you go. Perhaps I uh, upset it a little bit. But there we go, I mean, it's, um, you know, it's new technology. Um, it works fine. You know, this is the, like I say, a few times that I've boiled it, it does the job. Um, you'll find that there's going to be a lot more products um, out there with this Wi-Fi connectivity. Um, I hear there's going to be a microwave, uh, there's going to be an oven, a washing machine, a dishwasher. There'll be everything. Everything, you'll, you'll be connected to Wi-Fi and turn on and you won't have to uh, to move a finger. Um, obviously, it's not a tea it's made. You know, it just boils water. Um, that's what it does. So, um, yeah, you know, if you want a tease made, buy a tease made. Um, I just like the functionality. 
of much stuff in the house um, as I could get that uh, that was Wi-Fi connected. Um, I didn't say earlier, but um, uh, this company is the the only company that actually um, has these in stock at the moment. Um, so if you want to uh, to uh, to get one, you have to get them from uh, from that company. And um, yeah, so that's my my review. So what do I give out of ten? Well, it's the first one on the market. It's got to be a, a clear ten out of ten, hasn't it? Um, hopefully, they might improve some of their functions on the on the on the app. Um, but you know, to be all honesty, it does exactly what I expected, and uh, so uh, it gets ten out of ten for me. All right. Well, thanks very much. Hopefully, you enjoyed this, and uh, please thumb uh, give me a thumbs up if uh, you enjoyed this in uh, this review. Thanks, now. Bye.